is a multiple choice question. Is the government's decision to abandon online NAPLAN next month A, in our kids' best interests, or B, a desperate cover-up of another horrendous government IT stuff-up? It's a bungle. Oh, I think that's totally unfair. Queensland was to join Victoria and other states switching from paper and pencils to something more high-tech next month. Now the government's announced the system's just not ready. It's not just the state government. Of course, it's the federal government that is actually working with us on this. Uh, we feel as though it is not right just yet. Educators say it was a problem with the layout. Instead of seeing, for example, five elements, might only see three elements of a maths question, um, and obviously then they can't do the question. A smokescreen, according to the opposition, to hide problems with the government's IT. I mean, who can forget the health payroll debacle? In the end, the government believed it wasn't worth the gamble, not when Queensland NAPLAN results are slowly improving. It's not a reflection on Queensland and its readiness. It's around the testing platform which has been nationally developed. If the test isn't working, then no one wants to be putting students through that level of stress or anxiety. Shane Doherty, Nine News.